The amalgamation started almost right away, but it's really hard to see. In the reflection, you can see me lean over to get a better look, and I noticed some very small hairs forming between the aluminum and the mercury. In real time, this process is really slow, so I set things up for a time lapse. So the major thing going on here is the combination of the mercury with the aluminum to form the amalgam. Some of the amalgam that forms gets dissolved in the mercury and makes its way to the top. When it gets there, it comes in contact with oxygen in the air and it reacts to form white aluminum oxide. This part of the process is pretty short-lived though because it quickly gets covered and protected by the oxide. This prevents fibers from growing directly from the mercury but obviously they continue going out from the sides. This happens because some of the mercury is dissolving into the aluminum. The amalgam here also reacts with air to form the oxide, but the difference is that it doesn't shut itself down. The dissolved mercury can continue to creep along the surface and amalgamate more aluminum.